Peggy 16. An open letter to my best friend, Jessica. Tyler. Nicole. My best friend, Ginny. Gidge. An open letter to my best friend, Garland. Where to even begin? Let me start this off by simply saying I love you. I probably don't say it as much as I should, but here it is. It is hard to pick just one thing to say, other than thank you for making me a stronger person. Thank you for being the wonderful person you are. We've been through so much. And meeting you changed my life forever. You were this snot-nosed third grader with an oversized Pokemon shirt. It was like Christmas, when you get a new puppy. <laughs> but instead, I got someone I could call my best friend, my little brother. It wasn't until we wrote that short play that I realized this is a person I need to stay around. This is someone who makes me better. From that moment on, it was pretty safe to say it was going to be the two of us forever. And all the small victories I've had over the years may have never happened without your support. I laugh louder. I smile harder. I'm home. I think what tied our bond forever, though, is when you decided that I was the friend that you would call to tell your biggest secret to. Throughout everything in my life that has changed, rearranged, and flipped upside down, you are the constant. Garland, your testimony is one of the most powerful things I have ever heard. <sighs> See that hard? I thought it was going to be. I am so proud of this amazing person you have become and continue to be. During one of the most difficult times of my life, you were the life I needed in that very moment. You are an inspiration to my life, and I could have never made it to where I am without you being there for me in so many ways. You helped me to keep fighting to keep pushing to get out and try each day. You've been the legs to my broken heart, pushing me through and carrying me on. For that, I owe you my life. Thank you for always setting me straight, being the family that I needed through those times and not giving up on me. You continue to challenge me to face the parts of myself that I love, that I hate, and that I want to be. You have seen me at my worst and have brought me to my best. But you are forever and always a part of me. You anchor me in my true self. You make me feel loved. You are my brother. I love you. Uh, that was written by my best friend, Haley. My best friend, Angela, she wrote this letter. My best friend, Melvin. My best friend, Diana, wrote this letter. You got me in tears over here. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, I fucking love you. I needed that. <laughs> Thanks. I love you too.